Tens of thousands of President Trump supporters descended on Washington on Saturday for a protest to back his unsubstantiated claims of election fraud as Trump pushes ahead to try to overturn President-elect Joe Biden's victory. Trump's motorcade drove by some of the protesters in downtown Washington Saturday morning on his way to his golf course in Sterling, Virginia. not even close to being over and those people that are telling you right now that it is over are lying to you the vote has not been declared but they, no there is no president-elect it's all a lie among the protesters were members of the far-right proud boys group clad in black with some wearing helmets and ballistic vests the trump supporters many not wearing masks marched from freedom plaza near the white house to the u.s supreme court Trump has so far refused to concede to Biden and claims without evidence that he was cheated by widespread election fraud. But state election officials report no serious irregularities and several of his legal challenges have failed in court. Good afternoon, everyone. On Friday, Biden further solidified his victory as results showed him winning Georgia, giving him a final tally of 306 electoral college votes, far more than the 270 needed to be elected president. The 306 votes was also equal to Trump's tally in its 2016 victory over Hillary Clinton, which at the time Trump called a landslide. At a White House event on the coronavirus response on Friday, Trump appeared close to acknowledging the likelihood that he will be leaving. Ideally, we won't go to a lockdown. I will not go. This administration will not be going to a lockdown. Hopefully, the, the uh, whatever happens in the future, who knows which administration it will be. I guess time will tell. States face a December 8th deadline to certify their elections and choose electors for the Electoral College, which will officially select the new president on December 14th. And in normal Trump fashion, the president doesn't plan to stay away from the limelight once he leaves. Aide said he has discussed possible media ventures, like a television channel or a social media company, and appearances that would keep him in the spotlight and his true believers fired up ahead of a possible 2024 White House bid. Um.